And what we're saying is that we envision a world that is connected in 2020. So we're not talking about just people. So we want to emphasize it's not just about connected consumer electronics we're talking about. It's not about just camcorders or uh, televisions or games or uh, playstations with, with these connectivity capability. We're saying that we will have different businesses will take advantage of that. For example, utilities, industries, transportation, health. And if you keep clicking, there's a... So, so what are the enablers here? The broadband connectivity. Again, this is all about mobile broadband. As the forecast suggests, the next five years is tremendous growth in mobile broadband. That's where the billions are going to come. So now you have ubiquitous broadband coverage, and the cost of connectivity is going down. But new business models in different types of businesses, as diverse as entertainment and security and regulation, is, it's all coming together. In, in one way. What would be the connections there? Well, these are some preliminary forecasts, but it shows an exponential growth. I think the number themselves is not critical as the, as the rate of growth is, is going to grow. And this indicates that we're going to hit a point where the cost is so low that it becomes economical to create these business models, which will further drive the growth of machine to machine. <coughs> And, and then we're not looking at just uh, you know, value-based, but also wholesale pricing. All those will kick in. So where does Ericsson come into the picture? Again, it's about mobile broadband. Mobility gives power. You can be anywhere, anytime. At the same time, it's a little tough to harness. It's not that simple. So what we are saying is we can provide the connectivity and allow our operators or our customers to take advantage of of the of the built-in capability of the of that link for example uh, the, the the applications can be much more connection aware meaning there can be some time critical applications which should get priority over non critical video downloads for example so so that's where the network becomes a differentiator and will be a catalyst in the growth in the coming years